When you look at physiological birth and physiological labor, it's not dangerous. We have all of these safeguards, we have all of these hormones, and we have all of these things in place in our body that makes us strong and capable and powerful and able to birth babies. When you look at taking women out of their natural place where they're safe and they feel comforted and they feel at home, and you put them into this medical setting where there's lots of bright lights, lots of people they don't know, lots of people touching areas that are private and sacred to them, lots of interventions lots of in synthetic hormones, um, epidurals and pain relief. These things are great. Modern medicine has saved many lives. But now we need to look at what's happening with our complications that are arising for women in birth. And this is especially, again, affecting people, minority, low income. So if you are one of these women who are watching, it is important for you to pay attention to this. You need to understand that you have the power to say no to any intervention when you walk into the hospital. From any intervention, from that initial cervical exam, to that epidural, to that IV, to the Pitocin, to any other thing that they want to do to you. You are able to educate yourself about physiological birth and you can say no.